He's poking a skinny connector into the Roomba serial port. And nope, it doesn't fit. This is deja vu for every DIY gone wrong. Classic, he thought it would just slide in like USB on the first try. Spoiler, it never does. Plan B is sanding the seven pins with paper like he's giving them a spa treatment. And it works so they finally click into place. So who knew exfoliation was a valid engineering step? Now he strips off the insulation from some wires and slides on thinner heat shrink so they don't touch each other. Meanwhile, the others keep their chunky jackets. This bundle looks like a fashion show of mismatched cables. He adds a bigger sleeve, heats it up, and now the whole bundle looks like a shrink wrap sausage. Wait, now he's spooning in baking soda and drizzling superglue. Is this robotics or kitchen chemistry? It hardens instantly. Frankenstein's connector is alive and he pours more glue straight onto the pins to lock it. Time for the multimeter moment. Two wires at 14 volts, the rest whispering TX and RX jackpot. So next stop Raspberry Pi 3B. This room is about to start texting us back. Final touch another sleeve bent at 90 degrees for strain relief. It looks sketchy, but hey, it works.